All right, this is the uh, Algebra 2 end of course practice test. This is question number 7. Uh, the question says, which is the equivalent to 2 minus 5i times the quantity negative 2 plus 5i? So since there's nothing between our parentheses here, we know this has to be a multiply question because they're touching. When they touch, they multiply kind of like hamsters. Now, the reality is we're going to treat this just like foil. I'm going to write it down here a little lower. Uh, you can't see it, but in my classroom, the board is higher than I can reach the top of, so I'm doing it so I have a little place to write, and I can reach it more appropriately. So I'm going to do my 2 times negative 2, end up with uh, negative 4, of course. Then I want to do my 2 times 5, so I end up with plus 10 i. Then I want to do my insides, so it's negative 5i times negative 2, which gives me plus 10i again. And then finally, I have negative 5i times 5i, which gives you negative 25i squared. And what you should know about i, of course, is that it's an imaginary number. Uh, the i is the equivalent of the square root of negative 1. Now, if I have the square root of negative 1, and I multiply it by the square root of negative 1, which is what i squared is, then I end up with negative 1 because the square roots cancel out. So in this case, what I'm really doing is looking at negative 25 times negative 1. Because i squared, by its definition, would be negative 1. So I'm going to rewrite this as negative 4. I'm going to combine my i's together here, so plus 20i. And then I've got this negative 25 times negative 1 thing, which makes it plus 25. Bring my real number terms together. 25 minus 4 is 21, plus 20i. So based on that, my answer should be C.